Hi, NACED members. I'm Laura Di Maria. I'm the executive director of NACED, and we have a very action-packed and exciting week coming up. And so I wanted to share with you a little bit of information about what we're getting into this week, rather than just writing about it in our alert. So first thing, Heather and I are going to HUD headquarters on Wednesday for two meetings. One is with Ralph Gaines, who's the Principal Deputy Assistant Secretary of CPD. Uh, we know Ralph, we've met him before, some of our members have met him. So that's a little bit just of a check-in, um, just to see how things are shaping up this fall. And then after that, we're going to meet with Neil Ratcliffe, who is the Assistant Secretary for CPD. So those of you who came to our annual meeting uh, last month in Portland, Neil gave a presentation. He had to do so remotely because of everything that was going on here in DC uh, with the disaster relief funding. So this will be our chance to meet with him in person, share a little bit more about what NACID members do, your stories and how we can work together. So we're excited for both of those meetings, the check-in as well as um, really continuing to build on the relationship that we've begun to develop with Neil. And then after that, later this week as well, we have a meeting on the Hill with a staff member from Mario, Representative Mario diaz Bilart's office. So um, Mario diaz Bilart is a congressman from Florida and he is the chair of the T-HUD subcommittee, uh, you know, which is, which is of course important for the work that our members do at the county level and the city level. So this new staffer, um, his name is Chris Sweet. He's not new to the office, but he's new to his position. So we wanted to go introduce ourselves, talk a little bit about NACED, and look for ways to work with him as well. And just in general, we've, we've heard rumors of maybe some sort of HUD-related hearing on the Hill. Um, we're keeping an eye on that. We'll see what develops and attend if necessary. A couple of other things that we're working on this week, we're putting together a uh, the schedule for our spring legislative meeting. So that's going to be March 1st through 4th of next year in 2018. Um, more details to come. Registration will be open before the end of the year. Hotel details, everything else. We're excited though because we're adding a little more programming this year. A um, couple of workshops and new speakers who, who we haven't had before for our members. So we're very excited about that. And then, of course, later this month, again, we'll be recording another podcast episode. And if you didn't uh, get a chance to listen to either of the first two, we definitely encourage you to you just go on iTunes or Stitcher is another platform. Search for the Holistic Housing Show or Holistic Housing Podcast. Um, we've had some great guests. Just last Friday, we had guests from the New York City Housing Development Corporation, Eric Enderlin, the president, and Elizabeth Strojan, their director of um, government affairs and public policy. And we talked about tax reform and LIHTC and their paths that brought them into affordable housing. It was a great conversation um, and very enlightening uh, in terms of you know, the passion that people who work in this industry what, what they're bringing into it with their passion. So please listen, let us know what you think and if you liked it and stay tuned for more information on how all these meetings go. Um, we'll be sending stuff out through the alert uh, and, and through different emails. So thank you for your support and we will talk to you again soon.